Yeah, thanks. What you've accomplished. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Is that a compliment? Well, don't misconstrue. I'm sure the whole endeavor will end tragically. But to have come this far, well, it's more than I ever expected. The people yearn for freedom but fear to grab hold of it. That fear is gone now. Thanks to you? No. This they did on their How own. How do I get my gear back? But you have always been of humble heart. Humble hearted, Connor. Right. Sure. No more, no less. <laughs> you cannot tell him. I have to. Otherwise, he will never be safe. He is safer not knowing. By planting the seeds of doubt, you threaten to topple his entire endeavor. If Washington is paralyzed, Charles Lee will strike. You'll cause the very thing you aim to prevent. That's true. Hunt the Templars as is your duty. That's but a good do not point. Drag these men into it. That's a good point. Inter this door? Okay. We must now all hang together. Yes, we must indeed all hang together. Or most assuredly, we shall all hang separately. You are once more our savior. I must speak with the commander. He's gone to try and hold New York. The British intend to take it. I fear we'll need to recall our men from Quebec as well. It's one thing to declare our independence. Now, my friend, we must make it so. We have to... Oh, sequence 8 completed. Wow. Oh, oh, right. I forgot about this. Everything all right? Sean has located a second power source. I've asked Rebecca to charter a flight for us. Okay, okay. Where to? Brazil. I totally forgot about Juno in, in the modern day stuff. Brazil. Okay. And these are supposed to be the stereotypical Brazilian people. <laughs> Very boisterous crowd. You there, Rebecca? They're all that tall gangsters. <laughs> well, I'm glad to see that's working. So I'll try you back when I'm topside. <laughs> Everyone's pushing me, even though there's <laughs> plenty of space to go around me. <laughs> it's not a crowded platform, all right? <laughs> and all the women have, uh... Pretty, uh, oh, I don't know. Something just looks strange about them. Other than like the, the, the lines, you know, the texture lines, but something else looks strange. I can't tell what it is. Oh, it's like the way they hold their arms. I think maybe, I don't know. Oh, oh, her elbow. Oh, shit. When she stretched it, it fucking broke. Let's see if this one can break. Oh, oh God! Oh, God. oh, it, oh, oh, oh! Her elbow. Oh. <laughs> oh, and this guy's bicep is a different color than the rest of his arm. It's shiny too. Their elbows are totally fucked, though. And see if this oh yeah oh 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 god there's styrofoam tubes oh wait oh i'm sorry i did not mean to do that well i mean i cut whoa whoa wow wow <laughs> sucker and she's just like the center of attention here, smoking her cigarette. 
and she's doing it with class are they gonna go back to kissing here hey she actually looks good whoa whoa she really went in there dang they are not kissing each other's mouths his his mouth is inside of her cheek oh it went in her eye oh this is this is not as pleasant as i originally thought <laughs> um don't mind me i'm 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 just uh <laughs> Sorry dude Whoa what's happening here What she's scared of him What's she? Yeah, push this guy aside. What's going on here? What? Oh, and now he's doing the same animation, but he's here. He's talking to me now. But what? Why was she scared of him doing this? Oh, he wants to feel my balls. You want my balls? Here, here. You can have them. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, you like you like that? Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> oh, oh yeah. Let's let's embrace. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh. He's rubbing. He's rubbing my waist. <laughs> And she wants to touch me too and she's got the broken elbows as well don't mind me dude they have a surprising amount of like just npc interactions going on in here it's pretty good though and they're all like pretty in i like watching them by some tycoon's trophy wife. We're working on pinpointing her location, but she's most likely inside a VIP booth on the stadium's upper level. I'll update you when I know more. Now to find a ticket. I don't have a ticket? Oh. Well, I guess you could try and sneak past security instead. Let's steal one. Am I a good guy or am I a bad guy? That doesn't look like normal security. Oh, I can't be detected, can I? I probably should have seen that coming. Is this the reloading screen? I'm assuming it is. Whoa! Well, I tried to steal, but the button for it's not working. Dude, his spin. Ooh. I'm wanted? That's me. That doesn't look like normal security. Because it isn't. Those are Abstergo agents. Cross is probably here too. You need to be careful. I could go up in there. He is looking this way though. I'm in. Do something. Oh. Definitely in the VIP area. The entrance is at the end of the concourse. Which there's gonna be more Absurgo guards, right? Yeah, there's one over there. Mission. 
blend. And here's the way around security. Okay, where's the VIP entry? Looks like I'm close. Shit! Another checkpoint. You're gonna have to find another way around. Security too tight. Um, we'll go under here. Watch your back. They're on. They're on to me? Oh, I didn't even mean to go up here. That was pretty sick. Almost there, just on the other side of the Blend. Blend, 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 blend. I'm blended. Dude. Wait, did he not notice? What the? Alright. Wait, no one's gonna notice this? I want to watch them fight a little bit. Wait, they're just in clothes. Oh, shit. Okay, bring him to the ground. Bring. Oh, he getting some knee jabs in the side. Oh, he got him on the ground. Oh, he's getting some, some jabs in there. Oh, but he got him off of him. He's recovering. Oh, he's got him by the head. Oh, knees to the face. Oh, fuck. All right, now it just repeats. That was pretty good, though. This is where I was supposed to go, right? Crosses here. Hey. Hurry, Justin. I have to catch him. If he gets away with the artifact, you can't let that happen. Get the okay. out of my way. Oh, that was a sick jump. Wait, why is he knocking security out of the way? Does security not like him either? Why are we doing this on the pots? Can we get off of the flower pots, please? Dude, I like how he, he, Oh, shit. I like how in this mode, like, you don't get the benefits of the Animus HUD, you know? It kind of... It makes it harder, but it's like... It's cool. Oh, now the actual police. Go, 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 go. Train, 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 train. Gotta get to the train. This way. In here. And we're in. That was sick.
I feel like I should play Half-Life at some point. That for some reason reminded me of Half-Life. I've never like actually played it. We can get back to Connor whenever you're ready, Desmond. Unless you want to plug in the power source first. Up to you. I definitely want to plug in the power source first. Let's go plug her in. I think it was over here, this one that opened up. I think incremental lore dump is better than all at once. What is a fact? Is it fixed? Immutable? Certain in its existence and only awaiting discovery? Or might it be changed? Here we heard the answer and thought that it might be us. They were used to command, to control, to own. But we soon discovered another use. When enough sat in thrall and were told to believe, their thoughts took on form. What is imagined became real. If a hundred minds could wish away a wall or create a tree, what might a thousand do? Ten thousand more. Might we change the consensus and will the threat away? We resolved to send one into the sky where it might illuminate us all. Once placed, a sentence would be uttered. This is deep. Make us safe. In this way, we would change the consensus. We would save the world. And? But it never came to be. We sent a dozen of them skyward, but there was no way to maintain control, to direct the beam, to enthrall the world, to speak the words. Though this was strange and dangerous, what we tried next was worse. Which was? Oh, come on, the cliffhanger. Uh. Which we'll get once we climb this. Yeah, okay. Our first instinct was to travel back, to change the past, but we could not find a way. But forward. We could look forward, and so here we sought to see beyond ourselves, and know what was to come. Uh... First we watched to learn if our work would succeed. But the answer was always the same, so we moved on to other things. But she remained. The one you call Minerva. In time, Minerva. she too stopped looking. And instead began to speak. She called out across time in the hopes that you might be saved. Ooh. She hid messages where none might find them, save for you and those within this place. Fascinating. Yeah. I'm tired of it. The cryptic warnings, the threats. Just tell us what you want. But they are. We saw the Nephilim there. We seemed like grasshoppers in our own eyes, and we looked the same to them. Imagine trying to explain all this to a two-year-old, to a grasshopper. When they said the will of the gods was unknowable, they meant it. Literally. I killed her, you know. I killed Lucy. He did kill Lucy, that's true. It was the Apple, son. It was Juno. I saw what she was. What would happen if I let her live? I could have stopped myself. I mean, there was a force there, but I didn't have to. I chose to. Desmond. Lucy was going to betray us and take the apple back to Abstergo. I saw the satellite launched. I saw them turn it on and then... It what? Failed. Whatever's on the other side of that door, 
it benefits Juno. Huh? We need to be careful. Lucy was a traitor or was going to be. Wow, that was did I know about this before the year that unless I'm mistaken, I thought this was the first I heard of it. Wow way after all of that wait why was why would she want to go back to abstergo is there more to this or is that it like don't 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 spoil it if there's more behind it but if there isn't like why was she just tired of it all was she like i want it all to be over like that kind of thing or like what what because she she went through so much that told me everything I needed to know. But, but why? She was a double, double agent? So she... That is... So... She was an Abstergo originally then became an assassin for years and years and years and years and years then got desmond out of abstergo abstergo meanwhile actually still knowing that this lucy girl is their double agent and she's gonna break desmond out of there that was all part of abstergo's plan and then Wait. And and so then they escape and uh, like as Ezio he finds the apple of Eden because Ezio's after he escaped Absurgo. And now Lucy knows about the apple of Eden. They go and get it. And now she's like okay. I've done my job for Abstergo. I need to get this apple back to Abstergo. And so Juno got him to kill Lucy because Lucy was going to get Desmond killed. Dude, that is... That is pretty good lore. That's some good lore writing there, I'd say. Can I go through this little slit? No. That would be a little too easy. Is this where I go next? Not quite sure. Oh, this was definitely not the way. Right? Or. This is a little confusing. Oh, or was that. Yeah, the relationship was built. Was that a lie too? Yeah, because how do we know what Desmond saw was actually the truth? You know? Because the... The assassin motto is like... What is it? Like, there are no rules. Everything is possible or whatever. So, by assassin motto... The truth that was meant to be... Or that he saw didn't necessarily have to be the case because as assassins you can change 
the truth. Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. So... Oh my, so we, we really will, oh wait, this is the way I came. So we'll really never, never fucking know. Also, what am I missing here? Oh, you're talking if she actually had feelings for Desmond? Well, but I mean, it still seems as valid that like, what if she actually wasn't a... What if she decides she wasn't gonna double agent? What if she was actually gonna be like, you know what? I love this man and, uh, and, um... I, I'm not gonna be a double agent no more. Where the fuck is the... Uh... Oh, we're not going up that. Can I climb either of these? No. I need to get up there. First Civ stuff has nothing to do with assassins? Wait, I wasn't talking about First Civ stuff, was I? I, I was just talking about Lucy. Wait, there's a way up. I need to figure out how to go up. Is it this? Um Wait, let me look at this So I need to get over there which means I need to get there Which is level with where I am now Which means yeah, right there. How the fuck do I make that? I can't get there from here. I have to get up. Somehow. So how do I get up here? Can I climb this little column here? No. Am I able to climb this yet? Or am I missing something? I fit. There's got to be a reason for like these slides. But I don't know what. You know? I already tried this. I didn't see this room. There we go. Okay.
Okay. Which door did that open? Wait, I missed it. Where was that door? I'm telling <laughs> you, there's something down here. <laughs> don't be daft. I don't know. Maybe they were sleeping or something and we woke them. Some kind of cryogenics or hibernation. I mean, how do we know what the hell they were doing down here? They were working on a bunch of different solutions, but nothing worked. Just went from one to the next, and then... I don't know. They must have left at some point. After the end. I wonder what the world would be like if they'd succeeded. I'm more concerned about what it'll be like if we don't. Salvation. <gasps> we found a way. Too late for them. But not for you. Sealed. To protect it. Though now it bars your way. Find the key. The past will tell. Oh. Wait, where is... Is that the door that opened? Did it open? Please be the one that opened. Because otherwise I have no idea which door opened. It is this one that opened. Perfect. Okay, we'll go there when we get the next key. And let's let's get our little juicy dialogues. I can't believe it's taken me so long to ask, but how's mom? She's not. No, 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 no. Your mother is fine. We decided it was safer if we split up for this job. Always assuming the worst. <laughs> for good reason. Can I at least say hi to her? I'm sorry, it's too risky. Ooh, that Maybe hurts. Maybe when we're done. Right. When we're done. Yeah, I, I got an STD test today. Um, it's my first... It, it, well, it's a screening, not a test. Test is when you think you have one. Screening is like when you're just getting it done, like just in case, you know? So this, But this was my first one ever. Which... I probably should have had one a while ago. Um... But yeah, so far, like, the first three have come back, uh, positive. So, it's looking good. Oh, I, unbelievable. What's up? Your and I, Cherry and Forrest, are constantly okay. referencing the Founding Fathers and insisting they must have been in support of one thing or another. I have never seen such a blatant disregard for history. That's just typical political propaganda. It's also dishonest and delusional. How can anyone claim to know what these people wanted based off scraps of paper and wishful thinking? They're looking for intent. What these men envisioned for our country and its future. Idealistic and unlikely. I don't think most of your presidents and senators and judges care what the founders thought. They just want to know how they can bend old words to achieve modern goals. That's true. Who cares if they were deists or theists or wanted a central bank? Why do people need the validation? What should matter is what you, as an individual, believe, and why you believe it. What, are we so insecure that we have to find 18th century letters to validate our beliefs? Oh, look, Mum, a dead man agreed with me. Maybe. If you transpose the letters in his shopping list, you can plainly see he was on my side. Jesus, Sean. That's a cynical way to look He's at it. He's fucking Doesn't right, though. True. That was facts right there. That's like the first time I haven't wanted Sean to shut up. And he even still said it in a way that kind of made me want to, but he was right. <laughs> so, what's the latest? Learn anything interesting while you were exploring? They were working on some weird stuff towards the end. Trying to engineer new bodies and store their minds inside computers. Failure after failure. It must have been hard for them worry about it too I mean they say there's something in here that'll help us but what is it why is it locked up if it's exactly what we need I don't know maybe it's dangerous maybe they wanted to make sure only you could reach it that's the other question what makes me so special I guess we'll know once we open the door all right it's time to get back in VR 
Prawn, here we go. I found a third power source. Already. It popped up in an earlier search. But this is Assassin's Creed like 3. Where? There's a museum in Cairo with one on display. I guess Connor will have to wait. Oh, dang, no, we get another stay. key? We need to find that key, and time is running out. I'll make the trip. <gasps> what about oh. for us? Everything's going to be fine. I'll be back soon. Dude, what if my dad's a double agent? See, I don't trust anybody now. 